Hello YouTubers, this is uh, Mass33. I am filming the giant silk moth, also known as the polyphemus mouth. Uh, it's gorgeous. This is a female. They don't have a mouth. Their purpose is just to kind of breed and die. Sad for such a beautiful, gentle giant. Uh, I'm about almost 6'2", and I could grip the basketball, so this will tell you kind of like the size of it. And uh, that's my neighbor, bro. Real nice guy. And uh, this will give you kind of like, you know, I can grip the basketball. So you need not really exaggerated hands to grip the ball, but you need, you know, you, you gotta, you know, you gotta be big enough to grip a basketball, you know what I mean? That'll give you like a perspective of like, how big she is, because I don't have little hands. Yeah, she's beautiful, man, I tell you. These things right here reflect, are supposed to like reflect off uh, moonlight. Uh, and it, it's supposed to mimic predatory eyes. Also, she has two, and you can't see it because she's not fully spread. Um, these things right here come down and they also mimic looking like eyes and that'll be like for the daytime uh, in case they're somewhere in the daytime they also have two predatory looking eyes for the daytime uh, and they're bigger bigger circles and it's supposed to scare like birds away and you know stuff like that but uh, she's gorgeous I was just thinking about this animal about a couple of days ago because I seen a male and that's the first time I ever seen a male two years ago is the first time I ever even knew these things existed I was ignorant of this when I first saw it so I had to do my research going to the library and stuff like that then I got invited to a uh, kindergarten school to do a lecture on this which I thought was pretty awesome because I am not an expert in anything, but since I had captured it and I was going to release it uh, that night on a tree so you know, to maximize her um, survival, uh, I wanted to film her release and, and whatnot. And I don't know, I guess the school thought it was really cool and they, were, they wanted to be there and the kids wanted to be there. I didn't get, yeah, I didn't have this this phone, I didn't have an HD camera back then, but I really did wish I had a Blackberry, which the camera was okay, but not good enough for this kind of quality. But, uh, yeah, she's gorgeous, and, um, yeah, I just wanted to kind of show people, you know, what I saw. But I'm not going to capture this one. I'm going to leave this alone. She's really pretty. She's huge. Just kinda wanna I'm not exaggerating, I'm not putting my hand far and making it, you know, it's not an optical illusion. This girl is big, trust me. I have a big hand and she's not that uh, it's much smaller than my hand. Again, she's a giant silk moth. I think it's polyphemus uh moth. <sighs> correct me if I'm wrong, but you know, I'm but I think that's the correct uh Sign, sign, terminology, but AKA giant silk moth. Um, they're rare to see. Um, apparently, they're not really exaggerated rare um, in Florida, but they just people never see them. They could be here a whole lifetime. I, I've read that on on uh, on, uh, on some like moth places. Uh, websites that are dedicated to like these uh, rare giant species of moth and people could go whole, go a lifetime and never see one of these gorgeous little um, these gorgeous animals you know and here I am <laughs> I thought about this yesterday and here she is so I don't know if that's a coincidence but I just find that to be really thing but I think it's kind of telling me that yeah you know it's like nature telling me that it's okay it, it was okay that the last one was okay and 
and uh, not to worry because I was kind of worried as a man I hope I didn't interfere with her or thing but this is you know I know people will say no that's just a coincidence but again people can go a whole lifetime and never ever see one of these this is my third one I saw the first one a female the second one was like about a week ago that was a male he's probably like half her size if not smaller and here I go again another female that's that's just too much for one lifetime you know what I mean so I'm not nobody special I say but uh, I like to show a lot of love to people and everybody around me so I don't know if this is nature telling me you know we appreciate you but you know bless you and uh, thank you for giving me this opportunity to film you uh, have a good night it's about five in the morning so I'm going back to bed I gotta get up in two hours and go running four miles so alright youtubers I hope you enjoy this gorgeous animal again it's the giant silk moth also the polyphemus moth it's just it's a science term I think have a good day guys